I loved you once, Tony, but there's nothing between us. Now that I know you prefer dictation. Really? We're doing this now? I just watched Devin Weston's legal counsel get juiced in a jet engine. Oh, that Molly woman? Oh, Lord, that's horrible. You have no idea. She panicked, went crazy, and ran into it. But I saved the print, so we still got our movie. You believe that analog thing? It's all digital. We have backups everywhere. I mean, we're shooting on green screen. Well, you could have told me. I'm sorry. Look, I thought you knew. The edit's nearly done, and we've got to get it out before they can screw us again. I've greenlit a premiere. That will stop them from burying us. A premiere? For Meltdown? Okay. Can you invite my family? They can finally have something to be proud of me for. Of course! It's already on its way by courier. All right. Shit. I'll get ready. It was an American divorce, by the way. The movie quote. Obviously. I'm starting to understand why mom became a stripper and you robbed banks.
when I said it was for creepy perverts who run around the house in a jock strap, pecking away at a laptop. Hey, I'm not a pervert. I'm just really into fantasy sports. I have a fantasy football team. I think about it for hours. Fantasizing we just won. We're in the locker room. Half the guys are nude. We're really pumped. We're taking a shower. And then... And then... And then... Ah, hello, my friend. Hey, what are you looking so cool, calm, and collected for? I guess because I'm not the one who's about to die based on some inappropriate decision I made a long time ago. Ah, thanks for the moral support. I appreciate it. What the fuck ever happened to burying the past, huh? Any fool should be able to turn over a new leaf, right? Well, first, your new leaves aren't so very different from your previous leaves. It seems like they fell from a pretty similar tree. And second, the age of the internet, my ludite friend. Nothing is forgotten. There are no new leaves. Everything you do and don't do is recorded forever and used to beat you. This is the age of Judgment Day every day. And in the revelation of that, I'd say that you got off pretty lightly. What with all the, uh, the murders and the, and, and the thefts and... All right. This straight-talking new, uh, tell-it-like-it-is-reality guy act. Uh-huh. It ain't working so well for me. In that case, um, don't worry about it. Everything is fine. You're a good man and a great father, really. It's more like it. Hey, what's up, y'all? Hey. So what y'all talking about? The internet age. <laughs> the internet age? Oh, yeah. Man, ain't we got a highly defended federal building to fucking rob? Yes, we do. Let's get after it. I'm gonna miss this place. If we're gonna do this thing and maybe take that score... Well, I... I guess this has all got to be gone. All right, with the sad goodbyes. Agent Steve set up a base of operations at the Noose Building off the Palomino Freeway. All right, now, let's roll on this thing. Why are you so chipper? Shit, why are you so miserable? Must be an H thing. Great. Now, there's something to look forward to. What's the plan again, man? And please, let it involve someone shooting you for being so goddamn miserable. Oh, what is this? Pick on me day? Look, I know I'm a miserable old prick, but give me a break. You and Lester. Shit. So the plan was feeling sorry for your ass, right? I miss Lester saying that shit, but sure. Let's feel sorry for Michael. Rich. White Michael. Poor Michael, who robbed banks for 10 years, then got his slate wiped clean. Yeah, yeah. Poor Michaels, whose homies get into shit with the FIP out of the kindness of their own heart. Put their necks on the line. Man, where's my get out of jail free car, motherfucker? I'm sorry, okay? You know what, Mike? You a real easy dude to identify with, man. Poor me. Poor me. Man, pour me a drink, nigga. Okay. Okay. I can see. Maybe I've been a little caught up in myself lately. A little? Man, just give me the plan, okay? All right. Here's the shot. We're taking a chopper up to altitude, jumping out, and climbing in through the Bureau skylight. We hit the computer system. That might take a while, so we gotta hold off any resistance. Once we're in the system, we download the files, Chopper picks us up. Hey, that was real simple, wasn't it? I'm informed now, dawg. So you want to wallow in some more of your self-pity? Get another free therapy session? Actually, now that you mention it... Hey, fuck you. Honest and angry. This is some of the best mental health work I've done in years. Man, it's gonna cost you, homie. Trust me, you're gonna pay for that shit. The place is up here. Chopper pilot, gunman, driver, and hacker should be waiting. I'll radio in. Guys, you there? Always on time, bro. We're robbing government secrets out of a government building in a government chopper. Great. Okay, I need my engineer stationed outside the building calling in updates. On it, bro. I'll get over there.
Hey, right, here we go, man. This is on. Hello. All right, you're Haynes' pilot, right? We gotta wait until it's late enough, then we move in the chopper. You can take us up. I'll get on the stick when you jump. Agent Haynes said the timings were tight. Okay. Come on, Franklin. Let's go, buddy. Got it. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Better than an elevator. <sighs> ah, fuck. I'm in the building. I'm getting the hang of this heist work. Server room's in the bottom right of my plans here. It's locked. I'm setting a charge. Take the gun. Man, you really bring that piece to a raid on the federal building? You're lucky I brought anything on my salary. Let's just get ready for the security team. The alarm appears to be active. 
Yeah, no shit. An explosion will tend to do that. I'm looking at the terminal. The terminal, my bad. Connect your cell apps are on there. They better be. Yeah, I done did my homework this time. Access my computer. Your cellular will show as an external device, okay? Now let's get some linkage. Give me hack connect in this bitch. This little puppy's gonna locate your IP address in the network output. Now, let me school you. Your IP is a number. That number at the top. You're looking for it in the numbers in the middle. There's a lot of fucking numbers, bro. To be honest, I must have skipped this class in school. This is like way, way above my skill level. I might have to go back to school again. So I can drop out again. Okay, I'm connected. Then you are ready to bring down a firewall. Brute force, bitches. Boot it up. Here's some knowledge for your ass. This program tries lots of different passwords and picks off a letter at a time. When that letter comes up, you gotta get it, right? Real quick. So, like, yeah, you're trying to stop those red letters in, in the middle. There might be a bit of laggage or something. Oh, the password might reset if you lock the wrong letter, dude. I think... I think I'm in. Now start down and out, and let me go to work. Okay, people, we're rewriting history. Looks like security is right on top of you. Hear that? We gotta hold them up while this thing completes its process. Hey, we will prepare for this. Let's take it. I'm sticking here, guarding the file transfer! It's underway! We'll need that chopper ASAP! Get her over the building! Airlift confirmed. Approaching the tower. Got agents on the level. Drag this out! Hey, chopper's here! The process ain't finished yet! I'll hold here. Wait on your signal for pickup. Your shots are coming from up top. I should never have signed up with you. Eyes up. Left side of the roof light. Just back up a goddamn minute. Up and left. Four guys. Hang on, guys. MIB chopper, pick me up. Bringing it down. I'm taking fire. Come on! 